The holidays are here, and so is the Starbucks Caramel Brulee Latte. Rich, smooth espresso and decadent caramel brulee deliciousness will take you to your holiday happy place. Festive is a tap away. Order on our app today. Hi, I'm Bran, and I love the Love Club. I'm Brian, and I like the Love Club. I'm Dan, and boy, do I despise that Love Club. And this is the Deck, Deck the, the Hallmark, Hallmark Podcast. Podcast. Deck the Hallmark, it's this podcast. We hope you like this jolly podcast. Wow, wow, wow. You know that feeling at the end of uh, the marathon every year where it's like we did it, we accomplished something together. It wasn't always pretty. You're on a high where you don't want it to end? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's you. (laughs) You were once again out thinking the room there. Uh, You heard Brian at the end of the marathon. like, I don't want it to be over. You can do a couple more. (laughs) That's a good marathon. It was a good marathon. Uh, I... uh, I, that's how I feel right now about the Love Club. I feel wow. like you're on your own. I feel there. like we we've completed all the quadrilogy. Well, we haven't done it yet. Um, and we're so this there. is a big moment for us. It's a Friday. Mm-hmm. We're going to be done, and we're going to have a weekend. We're going to forget mm-hmm. it ever happened. <laughs> we're going to have a half bottle of wine at lunch, a full bottle of wine at lunch, <laughs> scotch and scotch out in the scotch evening. Out. It's going to be great. <laughs> scotch out. Oh boy, Friday already, man! Can you believe that? Flew by. You guys smell that? Mm. Is that Friday? Friday, Friday, Friday. And you know what that means is in less than seven days. Wow, what? we're going to be in yeah that Kansas City. That's going to smell good. And we're going to be at the record bar. Mm-hmm. Doing a little live show. You should join us. Then we're going to be at the Christmas Con all weekend long. Fun time. We got an Airbnb. Got a rental cool. car. We got some flights. It's going to be a fun little yeah, the whole company thing. trip. Bless you. Bless you. I'm freaking out. That's yeah, I'm so excited. He gets excited. He sneezes. So excited. Mm-hmm. That's true. It's a weird trait I have. I uh, yeah, sneeze it's only, an excited only sneeze. when I'm excited. That's right. Um, it's going to be so much fun. Yeah. I, I And we will not be conning people. Despite the name. Christmas no. con, no cons being had. That's, that's a con. We a con. are all pros. It, we, it's all above board, uh, non non for profit. It is for profit. Okay, it everyone for there profit. is for profit. Everybody there, know. everybody there is for profit. Yes. Wow. Mm-hmm. Uh, we guys, will give a portion of the proceeds that we uh, take in to, to the Brian Harold Funnel Cake Fund. Wow. Um, yes, we will. Yeah, 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 which is not for profit. Which is the so. uh, the BFF the the, the BHFCF, uh, <laughs> which we you know. It's a whole sure, thing. You can sure. look it up. Dot org. We, look uh, it up on the nonprofit yeah, right. o- o- uh, org, the non-profit. org chart. Right. It's one that's of right. the top rated for if you're going to give, right. the money goes right. to the cause. It it's goes right to the cause. Straight to funnel. It goes straight, yeah. down, straight, the straight down the funnel. Straight down the funnel. Straight down the funnel. We did take into a, a PPP loan during COVID, though, which was weird that we were allowed to take one of those. Yeah. I feel like you that and Tom Brady. wasn't used. We just bought funnel cakes with it, which is crazy. Yeah. It's worthy cause. Worthy cause. We bought our own funnel cake machine. We couldn't go out during COVID to buy funnel cake. So it's a good nonprofit is all I'm saying. Uh uh, super best. cool. Uh, you guys ready to talk about Tara's Tune? Oh, yep. born ready. The fourth time. of four uh, Love Club movies. Um, this is huge, monumental. Uh, March Club. March third, twenty twenty three, and it went a little something like this. Can you believe this? It's New Year's Eve. Uh, <laughs> it's New Year's Eve. It's, it's New stuff. Year's Eve. <laughs> Uh, Tara's with a boy, uh, her boy toy, a boy toy on a date. Um, he drops her off at the party. That's it. All in all done. Uh, some sort of dating uh, app. I don't know what they had back then. A dating website. Um, dating oh, facts. Uh, I don't know. Uh, anyway, uh, she, she sees those? Nicole being uh, bummed about the boy stuff. And they decide to hang out. They find the other girls. And wouldn't you know it, the love club. <laughs> Can you believe this? Have you guys heard this story? Stop me if you've heard it. Uh, <laughs> fast forward 10 years, and Tara is a singer. Uh, she ends her set and well, is... Close, if you're yeah, watching Philo, does what? TV I didn't do that. Um, and uh, she ends her set and uh, goes over and talks to this guy, Sam. Uh, it, apparently, it's Christmas, and uh, she's talking to Sam who's there at the bar on Christmas, uh, all in the up and up and about how he, she doesn't know. She doesn't think she needs, she doesn't even need a man. She doesn't need a man. She, uh, doesn't want to do anything serious. And, uh, she then goes on stage and rants about how she doesn't even want to get married ever. The night comes to an end and a guy named Noah comes in now. And Noah says, 
hey, I just got into town um, and I want to book a gig. So he plays Silent Night on the piano and sings it and Tara's hooked. What more do you need? Mm, book I mean, this guy. Until it's done. It's going to be great. She asks uh, to take a picture with him to send to her mom so that her mom will get off her back about being alone on Christmas. She tells him that she wants to re- uh, wants a record label in the new year. That's her new year's resolution is to get signed to a label. And he's like, well, good news. Garth Bryant's coming into town. The Garth Bryant? I know this goes without saying, but I'll say it anyway. Sure. That's a big deal. Um, so if you want a chance, this is your chance. Classic Garth Bryant. Um, she convinces the Love Club to come for New Year's, the week in between Christmas and New Year's, because um, she is going to do a love love myself ceremony. Uh, they get there. Tara immediately leaves. She immediately says, immediately I got to no. go. Um, no. Her mom calls. Sydney answers it to invite her to the wedding. Uh, or is it uh, someone answers it and says, hey. It's, it's uh, Nick. Nicole. Nicole. It's Nicole. Yeah. Nicole answers it. Sorry, faulty information here from the. I, I am using um, the the Baby Decker. Uh, uh, Little Decker. Little, Little Decker. Decker notes. Decker's is a show oh, that we boy. can't even air. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Super weird audio. Super weird audio. Shouldn't I'm not even going to dive into yeah. what that is. That was yeah, we so that. weird. Non-disclosure agreement. Um, right? Is that what it was? So her, uh, her mom calls. They answer it. They invite her to the wedding. Now, in their mind, it's the love yourself wedding. Mm. I'm getting married to myself. We've been to you've been to one you've been to one. Yeah. Go love um, yeah. I remember your love yourself ceremony. <laughs> it was crazy. It was super weird. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but Tara grabs the sixteen. We were at a Dave oh. and Buster's. Uh, it was wild. I tell you what, you got caught up in the moment. I did get That's caught right. up in the moment. I did get caught. I cannot go back out there. Uh, <laughs> Tara, <laughs> Tara, Tara is. Uh, <laughs> Uh, grabs the device and it's like uh, I am getting married to that guy in the picture, and Do they so know he's still in Greenville. Yeah, I don't even know he's yeah. supposed to be here. Yeah. Yeah. Have you let everybody in the neighborhood know? <laughs> um, so uh, Tara now tells her mom that she's getting married to a fella. So she's like, "What? This is crazy." Um, so then she goes to find the guy and is like, hey, would you mind, would you mind terribly fake marrying me? And he's like, no, not going to do that. But when it comes out that he needs a place to park because he lives in his van, she agrees to let him park behind her club in exchange for fake marriage. These two people are meant for each other. Uh, they start working on music together. They're singing. They're like, this is good stuff. We should. We are great. A great team. Uh, Tara decides that the best course of action here with mom being in town is uh, to just go ahead and go through with the wedding. Like, have it be real for the sake of mom and then get a no get the old annulment after the after the fact and so it's all above board uh garth bryant comes in looking like he just got shot a ton of times in his shirt um and uh here's noah singing and is like i want you only you and he's like well i got a bit of a duet situation going on here and he's like i want you only you i'm garth bryant so obviously tara finds out about this and he's like well what is going on here so she goes ahead and she comes clean and uh to her mom and is what what's going on what? You're good. Keep, oh keep going. and um it goes and she's like hey all of this was fake i was just trying to do this whole thing I am going to go ahead and still throw myself my, a personal wedding. I am going to marry myself. So if you can't get on board with that, what can you do? Um, so the we- wedding wedding's happening, and we all love it. He decides instead of going through with the whole Garth Bryant situation, she, he is going to show up to, to it and uh, is like, hey, I, I am a big fan of yours, and they sing together. And Garth Bryant does come in wearing his same shirt. And it's like, I love this. Uh, I want both of you. Stat. I'm Garth Bryant. They are thrilled. They kiss. And the love club, I guess, goes home. And that, my friends, was the, the love, love club, club colon Terrace Tomb. Wow, we did it. We did do it. Man. 
let's take a quick break. We'll come back and we'll break this movie down with four segments here on Deck, Deck the, the Home. Deck the home TM. 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 Adult version. It's the most beautiful time of the year, and JCPenney Beauty has gifts for all. Shop our newest brand, Smashbox and Too Faced Cosmetics, to check the glam off your list. Give it your all with designer fragrances from Calvin Klein and Dolce & Gabbana. Plus, check out the latest products from Murad Skincare and Olaplex Hair Care. With hundreds of brands and gift ideas, there's something for everyone. Treat yourself to a free mini service from our experts and book an appointment at our salon to get holiday ready today. And as always, shop online 24-7. JCPenney, make your holidays count. The holidays are here, and so is the Starbucks Caramel Brulee Latte. Rich, smooth espresso and decadent caramel brulee deliciousness will take you to your holiday happy place. Festive is a tap away. Order on our app today. Voila, voila. Welcome back to the Friday episode sure. uh, yeah. covering the fourth love club, mm-hmm. the third Squad. in uh, one week. We've reached the bottom. Uh, let's get to it. Let's break this movie down. Let's start with Brian. Brian, what do you think of Love Club colon Terrace, Terrace tune? tune? Sure. So help me. This one. So help me. Can I finish? <laughs> this one kept me on my toes. I... I, what, I had I couldn't watch it with you guys, unfortunately, but I had to keep coming into this room because I was just aghast at the idea that she's going to have a love yourself ceremony. Yeah. Um, but I ended up not disliking it as much as Lauren's oh, version. Oh, stop it! So I had stop I was it a bit more entertained and. Mostly because of the tie-in with music and songwriting and performing, that's that put it up a couple notches for me. Anything with working on live music is gonna is gonna do it. Writing a song together almost every time will get me. Uh, living in the van, that's funny. I don't. It wasn't supposed to be that funny. I don't think. But that's just funny to me. Being unhoused is funny. <laughs> yeah, hanging in a park. My kids. My kids caught the end of the second half of this with me and they were just like oh they felt bad for him yeah like, he doesn't have a home i'm like well he's he's touring around he's a musician like he's so they caught in- the end of the movie yeah well the second half ish right but can't you just say they caught the end of the movie they caught the end of the movie i could say that i'm just saying why say the end of the second half well, i said the end of the second half no, i think i, I thought started he said, the, he said the end then he stopped and said the second half. yeah there was, there was a pause it's like there. a hyphen got it Got yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, Got yeah. it. Sorry, you can see I, my confusion. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That was yeah. not because the end of the second yeah, half yeah, is yeah. the end of the that's the whole yeah, whole yeah, 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 ball game. Yeah, Twenty yeah. minutes. They two Corinthians. The two second Corinthians. Half. That's right. Yeah, it's a whole ball game. Uh, so I would definitely attend a vow renewal before I attend a love yourself ceremony. No doubt. No doubt. Yeah, I disagree there. Whoa! Wow. <laughs> Can't wait to hear that reasoning. Wow! Really. I don't know. They both sound miserable. Of course. But one sounds like you're just like an open bar situation. <laughs> like a vow renewal sounds like you, you drew, like we talked about. Yeah. You drew it's horrible. Hard. This sounds crazy. Yeah. You do get a good story out of this. Yes. The love yourself. You do. You get a, oh, yeah. yeah. Something wild. Yeah. Uh, you probably can't be friends with that person ever again. No, though. Like, never. That's the end of the friendship. That's the end if of you the go to that, and that's sure. sort of like end of friendship ceremony for you. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I, they did like the music. I, the music kind of bopped in this movie, except for the songs they were writing together. <laughs> like those, the music b- the, bopped. Yeah. Aside what else from was the music there? It was just wrote. like like track, like sound soundtrack music. You know, like the, the score. Music they didn't write. Bopped. Yeah, the music they weren't. Yes. Were, it was all because they were it. all ballads. Like they were all so, like slower songs. And I'm like, let's kick it up a couple BPMs. Let's get some like upbeat songs. And they were just not Byron upbeat. says BPMs like a big timer. <laughs> Classic Byron. Mike's lounge. Classic Byron Microphone situation. lounge. Uh, so I was just looking for more an upbeat original, but they were just, you know, classic songwriters just doing downers. Uh, I, you know what was great? No, they're not doing downers. They're doing downers. They're not doing downers. There was no downers In the downers musical done. sense. Yeah. In the Nobody musical Nobody took sense. any downers. Um, well, we don't know that. That's true. We uh, don't. Have you, you've never been to a I love yourself ceremony. No, I've never so. been to one. Uh, no, bro. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I liked, though, that was really, I felt true and realistic? Finally, Tara's apartment felt real. It was kind of small, cozy, like you saw people walking in the street outside her, her windows. Yeah. It, it just felt, like, realistic for... Was this, for, New, York, was this New York City? City? I think so. Yeah. 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 It's still too big. Still too big. Yeah, big. <laughs> for New York City, it's still it too big. It upstairs, didn't it? Yeah. I don't... Did it? I don't, oh, maybe for a bedroom upstairs. Maybe one room upstairs. A room? Did it? Know that. But, uh, so, yeah, this one, not, not my least favorite of the quad, the set. Okay. Yeah. 
So, Bren, what did you think? This one is my least favorite of the okay. quad set. Um, you're going to get wrecked in these rankings. So I just, I do want to, I want to say, good for me. No. there are two things here that I feel like have been poked fun at. One is living in a van, uh, and two is a love club ceremony. I would like to talk about both of love those things. Love yourself ceremony. Uh, what did you I say? Love, love club ceremony. Lo- lo- love yourself ceremony. All the time. One. Uh, As Higbones and Holly. He though. listen. He he's a That's musician. I've, seen. I, I've known my fair share of musicians that travel around. And they've they've trans they've made their vans into sleepable arrangements, sure. uh, believable. It is you know they, they it's 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 fine. Um, love yourself ceremony. While I've never heard of one, nor would I go to one. Uh, Sounds like if, legal jargon. Yeah. If yeah. if you have to say, if yeah. you have uh, thrown one of these, neither confirm nor. Um, all the power to you. I hope that that's worked out for you. I've never heard of it. I don't know if it's a thing. I'd be, it'd be a hard sell for me to go to one unless it is an open bar. I would not bring my kids. Um, so it's a tough, this was a tough one all around. I didn't like the music. I didn't like the ceremony. I didn't like the lying and it's a hard lie. It yeah, is not a yeah. fake relationship. This is a fake wedding that she is going to go all the way through. Real marriage, real annulment. Right. This is not, a slap in the face of love for this is, you. Yes. Yeah. Listen, yeah, for a I love a love. fake. I love a fake relationship story, but the, this was too much. This is a step too far. Uh, so overall, a. Bad, bad vibes for me and a bad time. Dan? Um, a line is said in this movie that's also said in, I believe, the second Love Club entry. Uh, four dumps doesn't make a charm, and that should be the tagline for the Love Club <laughs> movies. Um, <laughs> uh, because they're all oh, atrocious, yeah. and this one is the biggest stinker of you all. You know that saying? <laughs> four, <laughs> dumps dumps four dumps don't make, don't a, make charm. a charm. I know Put Dad. that on the DVD box set. Four dumps mm-hmm. don't make a charm. Daniel Thompson, Deck the Hallmark. Uh, this movie's bad. It's the worst of them. Why is it the worst of them? Well, because it makes no literal sense at all. Mm-hmm. Um, this movie is an abomination to the Love Club because it's it just it just like laughs in the face face of true love yeah. completely. Yeah. Goes basically is willing to like Chandler Bing going to Yemen, like willing to just like get married for Dig fakesies, um, but also makes fun of people that maybe don't want to get married. I felt like, hmm. like I felt like if you were someone that's like, no, I just want to be with me and don't want to be with anyone else and don't want to feel the pressure to get married. I felt like this movie made fun of people who are like that. Two, and so the music was bad the plot was bad it was offensive and maybe it was the fourth that was just piling on but i hated every single solitary second of it uh so it was not for me and nor was this series thanks but no thanks let's Thank get you. to the feels any feels brian so yeah i did i had a feel the songwriting but not the songwriting by the people who <laughs> right. this movie. i wrote the song i wrote down the songwriting clear just sitting around jamming with your band coming up with tunes is a blast do you you know what it really reminded me of though was right at the beginning i think it is she's performing in the club and there's a small crowd at tables and whatnot mm-hmm. it's christmas yeah. night sure yes. it's christmas Eve as everybody gathers you remember when we had dinner with E.R. Colin, Elizabeth, the author, yeah, the author, husband, I Martin, that. author Martin as well. And we yeah, were sat well. at a table and we all kind of looked the behind The author us. of The Lace? Of, well, of, the Dress. The Dress. The dress? The lace e.r. Colin. Not, um, come on. It's man. a big part of it. Read the Lace. Right. Yeah, read the book, literally. Uh, we sat down at our table and we all, me and Dan kind of did like a double take. We realized there were some instruments set up about three yeah, and a half and feet from us. And we were worried us. about the live we music. We were very worried about and it. And then it turned out. One of the best nights, we've, oh. Oh, one of the best times we've probably all had together. We were just shouting out song Requests, names, and, and he would JD Ross them. was jamming them for us. Like Who? JD Ross is JD his name. Ross is his name. He that's plays a good all shout out. Yeah, JD, JD. not a sponsor. Not and, a sponsor. No, 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 but, no, no, that's just free. And it's not. It, and he was just every tune we would shout out. Sugar Ray, uh, Mambo Number Five, Mambo Shumba five, Wamba, Shumba. Yellow Card. He was just busting Yellow Card. Come on, and uh, we have some video of it in the Facebook group, in our private group oh, from man. that night. And so that's what a, a time to be alive. To that reminded me of that time and how fun that Those was. Those are my feels as well. So you can mm-hmm. skip me doing sure. a bit, right to you, Brian. Like. Yeah. Um, uh, my my buddy uh, Britt Bristow at one point um, says that she still has thirty Hallmark Christmas movies that she has to watch. 
and I loved it. It's <laughs> meta. It's me. I loved it. Shout my out. feels back. <laughs> yeah, that's yours too. No, it isn't. That's yours too. That's Dan's too. That's Dan's too. That's Dan's too. That stands too. That. Okay. that stands too. Dan loves it. Dan loves it. Dan yeah. has. Dan, you have so many Hallmark movies on your DVR. So you oh, just, man. Just, just, so many. Same as the truth for you. Uh, we're gonna take a quick break. We're gonna come back with the way one. The Hallmark. Take the Hallmark. Take the Hallmark. Take the Hallmark. Take It's the most beautiful time of the year, and JCPenney Beauty has gifts for all. Shop our newest brand, Smashbox and Too Faced Cosmetics, to check the glam off your list. Give it your all with designer fragrances from Calvin Klein and Dolce & Gabbana. Plus, check out the latest products from Murad Skincare and Olaplex Hair Care. With hundreds of brands and gift ideas, there's something for everyone. Treat yourself to a free mini service from our experts and book an appointment at our salon to get holiday ready today. And as always, shop online 24-7. JCPenney, make your holidays count. Join us at Starbucks for the most magical time of the year when we don red aprons and handcraft delicious holiday drinks in our festive red cups that help get you in the holiday spirit. Stop into a Starbucks and taste the magic for yourself. Just saying, I wouldn't bring my kids. Yes. No, yes, who yes, would? You bring your kids. Awesome. I mean, if they're uh, like selling beer and lemonade. <laughs> Call back to yesterday's episode. Yesterday, well right done. Seems like yesterday. Uh, it's time for the way what is where we talk about what is movie made us go away. What and I'll start with you, Brian. Brian, anything stick out to you, bud? Yeah, a few few things, a buddy. Uh, when, buddy, when uh, when Noah rolled into town and he he just wanted a gig real quick to like to get settled in the town, and so he walked into a clearly closed club and decided to play Silent Night on Christmas night. On, on Christmas yeah. night for somebody who may or may not have. Like the authority to book him, yeah. Like just such a weird, like meet cute. I guess I would yeah. call it. It was just such a weird way to do it. I'm like that. I don't know. Uh, and one of the scene, a couple of the scenes actually, there was a van, a bright yellow van, parked in the background on the street, and on the van it said "refinishing is all we do." Dot com. <laughs> what? That's his van. It is. Yes. No. Yeah, because he he later we see a close no. up of it. Are you serious? Same yellow van. Are you sure? Because it had the writing on the side, but it said refinishing is all we do.com on it. On I his. don't know about that. It's a different van because that's a real business. That's a real hardwood floor refinishing business. Yeah. Cause you did some hardwood. You, <laughs> yeah. you, you, you own yeah. one of those. Yeah. Up, if you're in New Hampshire, everwoodflooring.com. Check that out. Okay. Buddy, you can't keep <laughs> doing those free plugs. So that, but JD Ross, everwoodflooring.com. They, they, maybe they made his van yellow because that van wouldn't move off the street because they were working in the house there refinishing the floors. But I'm like, that's so random and what a great name. And I looked it up and it's a legit finishing business, <laughs> floor finishing business. I just thought that was so, I don't know. It, maybe it's a what the hallmark, but it was. Just, I just had to point it out because it was just so random. The way to shout that out next time is, is in your feels <laughs> yes. segment. Yes, like it reminds me of mm. when I was back in New Hampshire. Oh, I finishing floors. A, yeah, yeah, that's how you. Do I that. wasn't even going to tie it back to Everwood Flooring, who uh, does, Ever, works Everwood, Everwood Flooring. Who, they, com? Works yeah. almost in in the north, you know, yeah. Massachusetts, North New Hampshire adults. area. Um, <laughs> when they did the rock paper scissors for the bedroom, did you guys catch this? They only did one two shoot. Yeah, oh. nobody does. Are you monstrous. kidding me? Monstrous. If we, one of us did that, we would never hear the no. end of that. Uh, and Mike's Lounge just had like the cleanest, most open office of any club, nightclub in existence yeah. ever in the universe. Uh, I have two more here. Two big ones, I think. The mom, uh, she doesn't even question the fact that Noah's family is not there. Correct. Or talked about. <laughs> and she hardly gets to know him at all. Like, she asks Well, him, no, but she knows it's fake the whole time. Oh, that end, came up? Oh. The end, we, know, right. we realize she knows it's fake. You're right. Still, like, to play along. Yeah. Like, nobody mentioned his family. That was a big... It cost re- more a, a money weird. and extras. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So, um, I can't do that. So, this, Nicole, Sydney, Lauren, Tara, all happened 10 years after the New Year's Eve. All of them. And I checked each one. They all said 10 years later. Great. So in the same year, they're they all, all taking this. a minimum of a week. That's by what the hallmark it's is they insane. All, all of, so all these people yeah. leave, and then in, in uh, exactly a decade from that night exactly, yeah. is when everything breaks loose in all of their lives. And they oh, had to right. take so much vacation yeah. time. And, they were, and Nicole was during Thanksgiving, uh, Sid, February, then 
Lauren, we don't really know, but soccer and school are happening. Spring. So probably, yeah. And then Christmas time for Tara. So four times during the year, you're taking a minimum of a week to go sit at someone's yeah. house. Like, oh. Wait, so Nicole's is Thanksgiving? Yeah. Remember, so it's technically start- a little over a year. Because Tara's is last. The other ones have happened. You're right. So well, it's it says, yes, yeah, but sure, still, sure. it's all in the same calendar year. Yeah. 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 No, if oh, yeah, no, Nicole's no. is first. So, yeah, it's like, oh, we'd have to go around. Months. Sure. 13 months is how long it was. <sighs> Just. And I knew this, we knew this was coming. Each one is, uh, all yeah. this is going, we're kind of, you. obviously it's ridiculous how much time they're all taking yeah. to go. But it's just, when you look at it, t- all within the same year. Worse than the wedding veil. Yes, because the wedding veil, they pop in and out in a day yeah. or two. It's just crazy. Un- you, can, you can't do it. Yeah, that was it. Um, y'all, you can't. Invite your friends. <laughs> Paula Dean? Like, what? Stop me if, if you've heard this y'all, before. Y'all. Y- they, no, you she can't. said she calls up the love club and she says, "Y'all, you got to get down here, stat. I'm doing a love love myself ceremony. Uh, <laughs> it's in like a it's an interpretive like art thing, and um, y'all got to get down here. They get down here. She's like, come on in, you guys, rock paper scissors to see who gets the better of bad sleeping arrangements. <laughs> I got to go deuces, wild. Like yeah, you're the it. worst. Mm-hmm. That's not friendship." Just peeves me right the O. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Language. Peeves you right the O? He's angry. Yeah. What does that mean? What does O stand for there? <laughs> off. Oh, peeves you right the O? Right the O. Peeves him right off. Peeves he, me he right off. Peeves the, me right O. Peeves me right O. Guys, you yeah. guys. Peeves me right O. You guys know me by now. Um, you don't know me by now. Peeves me right the O. Garth Bryant's one of the weirdest dudes of, uh, all, time. of all time. Of all time. That shirt was wild. But I all the thing that is craziest to me is that they hired someone to play Garth Bryant that looks exactly like the other employee of Mike's, yeah, right. uh, exactly. Mike's they, place. They were never on screen together. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not. To, they, they're, they're in yeah, the same the party, room, but yeah. they're never on screen. Where you get they are very both. similar so, so in uh, every aspect. Last but not least, if I did get an invite to a love yourself ceremony and I did go got a sitter for my kids I'm not bringing them to that um I I gotta be honest I'd ask for my money back if it ended in a kiss yeah I I was promised I was promised exactly right yeah yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm taking my toaster back that's right Absolutely not getting a gift I, for that. I uh, I have been promised. I have False been pretense. sold a bill of lies. I have been told that you are going to love yourself, and this is a ceremony for that. If it ends with a kiss with another person, I'm out of there. And you're already peed the. And the I'm, o already, yeah, I'm already I'm already peed the, the o. o. The o. So yeah, that's kind of where I'm at on it, Dan. Yeah. Um. I took umbrage at the fact that Nicole, now we're taking umbrage now we are right now is when we're finally going to do it go ahead, grab that laying umbrage. Around go ahead, everywhere. Go ahead and grab it. i'm going to take home. some of it how much uh, a lot wow. uh, uh, nicole who is is brit bristow who for all we know doesn't even know tara's mom hmm. tara's mom is facetiming in Tara's not in the room, and Nicole room. knows that Tara is planning this thing and hasn't talked, doesn't know if she's talked to her mom or not, and is like, you know what? I'm going to pick up this FaceTime call. Can you imagine no. someone picking up a FaceTime call from someone else's mom that they don't know very well or at all? I could not believe that that was the thing that got her here. You let that bug boy ring on out. You don't touch that. That is not your problem. Yeah. That's not even if you are like, if things go well in that call. It's not your place. That was unbelievable. Um, And then lastly, I also take umbrage that Tara is mad at this dude, Noah, for leaving to go record with Garth Bryant. He, Garth Bryant comes in and goes, hey, I want to sign you to a record deal. It's like life changing. He's like, well, it's a duet. And then Garth is like, I only want you. Well, you know what, Noah? You head on out the door because you've known Tara for under six days yeah. and she's roped you into a fake wedding that's going to be a real wedding that has to be annulled. You don't owe her anything. The idea that Tara is mad at this guy for taking a record deal when she's known him under a week mm-hmm. and all that he's done for her, forget it. That is so dumb. That's a good use of umbrage. Dude, that's du- double the umbrage, double I the fun. I got umbrage yeah. loaded up in the truck. I'm ready to is hit there, the road. Is there any umbrage left on the table? I don't know. You guys look. See if you can find some, sc- some crumbs down there. there. Some crumbage. Uh, so- <laughs> that was great. 
let's get to what the hallmark. It's uh, anything. Yeah, my only thing was anything it, PDVO. Anything, it's just something that, that was like, is that is it just me? Is cake smashing funny to anybody? Yeah, I've it's not. never found it funny. It's not funny. It's so lame, so old, tired. It's just not so funny. old, tired, so <laughs> old, so oh, tired, man. tired. Of course, so lame. All right, so it's not just me. All right, just wondering about that. Um, does she own Mike's? I don't know. That's a good question. It, it, she she's, says that she's been the manager or something. But, she seems to do everything from yeah, performing is, yeah. to booking to cleaning, cleaning yeah. to doing all, but just about all of it. Yeah. And uh, my other one is her band that is there on Christmas Day. Um, they do a, a funny thing. I, at least I found it funny. She says, I'm taking a break. We're taking a break. Um, this is a very short break. It's maybe two minutes. Yep. She goes to tell Sam to, to scram off. Uh, that band, uh, don't, don't you dare move. Don't you dare get off that stage during this break. Does the band ever actually get a break? Mm-hmm. Do they ever actually get to get off stage or are they just stuck there all yeah. Christmas? All Christmas. All Christmas. It's musician's life. Stuck. It's a musician's life. You got to do what you got to yeah. do, Dano. No, the two I had, we've already talked about briefly. One is all this happens exactly 10 years after all four yeah. of them. That's a stretch. And then who owns mics? Who owns yeah. it? They're never around. It is spotless, as you've said. Yes. It's a weird bit to have a nightclub that is bright and spotless and wide open. That is like... I want to know that person who owns that and has one person that does everything for it. Can I tell you my my last, and this is the biggest weight one of this entire yep. series, is you've done this thing and here's stories that happened 10 years after they originally met on New Year's Eve. And the final story takes place on New Year's Eve and they do nothing to celebrate nothing. the 10-year anniversary nothing. of friendship. Yeah. That's killer. Nothing. Absolute, I thought for sure it was going to all culminate yeah. back to, hey, let's go sit on a porch and New Year's Eve it up. We're not doing a separate Love Club ranking episode, right? We're just doing that real quick right yeah, now. Yeah, let's do it right now. Okay. Yeah. I can tell you my order. It's go ahead. My order is Tara's is last. Sure. Nicole's is third. Laura, Sydney, which one is the runner? Sydney. Sydney, Sydney. Sydney is second. Yeah. Sorry. Lauren That's the correct first. order. It's it's three, two, one, four. That's right. Three, two, one, four. Yeah. Four, four, one, two, three. Yes. Either way, you yeah, slice yeah. Three, or dice it. Three is the best. Three is the best. I uh, know. Three, two, All right, Brian. one, four. So you, no, I have, both agreed. That's the official. If you have Walmart four as the best one, I'm, I'm going to Tara. It's going to get. Yeah. yeah. No. Okay. I have Lauren as the worst one. Lauren, the marriage one. Uh, Tara. I, then I have, I have Tara and Nicole almost tied. I have them almost yeah. equal. Me too. Uh, but I would put Tara maybe a hair above. If I had to pick, so we one. all have Nicole at third. Yes, we do, and Sydney first for me. But yeah, Nicole third for all of us. Yeah, that, that's nice. Yeah, so we agreed there. But the the official order, yes, two, two, three, three, two, it's, two out of three well, of three, us agree. Two, two out of three doctors, yeah, yeah, exactly. Like right. you go with the and doctor. That's more than enough. Well. Uh, we did everybody congratulations next week back on uh, the regular uh, s- s- stuff we got new movies I think uh, there's a is there a new is there a new Lacey Dancy movie oh, this week sure wowzers wowzers uh, so much going on we got uh, wedding season whatever that is uh, su- uh, yeah, super dancing. fun the deadly yes the, the dancing the dancing detective yes. the deadly tango Pulse. Excited about that. Also, so plenty of up TV joints uh, this month, uh, all leading up to Christmas in July next month. It's we're very boy. exciting. Very yeah. exciting. Lots of fun stuff uh, on the horizon. We're going to be back then when we are. <laughs> Until sure then, are. first I wish you a Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Deck the Hallmark's a Bramble Jam podcast is produced by Aaron Shea. What? For more information on Deck the Hallmark, you can go to deckthehallmark.com. For more information on the Deck the Hallmark family, you can go to bramblejamplus.com. Deck the Hallmark is presented by Philo TV. For a free trial of Philo, go to philo.tv slash DTH. You're about to hear some ads that help keep the lights on here in the old studio. Thanks for listening or don't listen. It's really up to you at this point. It's at the end of the show. I mean, you're listening to me. Hi. But here they come. I promise they're coming. Yep. Here they are. Happy day. 
It's the most beautiful time of the year, and JCPenney Beauty has gifts for all. Shop our newest brand, Smashbox and Too Faced Cosmetics, to check the glam off your list. Give it your all with designer fragrances from Calvin Klein and Dolce & Gabbana. Plus, check out the latest products from Murad Skincare and Olaplex Hair Care. With hundreds of brands and gift ideas, there's something for everyone. Treat yourself to a free mini service from our experts and book an appointment at our salon to get holiday ready today. And as always, shop online 24-7. JCPenney, make your holidays count. Join us at Starbucks for the most magical time of the year when we don red aprons and handcraft delicious holiday drinks in our festive red cups that help get you in the holiday spirit. Stop into a Starbucks and taste the magic for yourself. Whether you're making the same breakfast that you have every day or baking a cake for an extra special day, eggs are a staple in our diets. Eggland's best eggs are nutritionally superior to ordinary eggs, containing more vitamins and 25% less saturated fat. Not only are they better for you, but Eggland's best eggs taste better too. There's a reason that they're America's number one eggs. Visit egglandsbest.com for additional information and delicious recipes. Dietz and Watson's been making meats and cheeses the right way since forever. What's that mean? It means never cutting corners, ever. It means cooking, not processing. It means our Virginia brand ham that's cooked to perfection, then twice baked to layer the flavors. It takes more time, but you can taste the difference. We come to work every day to do it the right way, even if it's the hard way. Because if it's not right for us, it's not right for you. Dietz and Watson, it's a family thing since 1939. Wayfair is ready to make your holiday season even more joyful. Shop all things home for you and everyone on your gift list with an incredible selection of furniture, decor, and more. All with an amazing value that'll make this holiday season the best one yet. And right now, Wayfair is turning up the savings even more with huge deals and sales. Plus, thousands of items ship fast and free. Head to Wayfair.com or download the Wayfair app in the App Store to shop the latest limited deals so you can deck it all. It's the most beautiful time of the year, and JCPenney Beauty has gifts for all. Shop our newest brand, Smashbox and Too Faced Cosmetics, to check the glam off your list. Give it your all with designer fragrances from Calvin Klein and Dolce & Gabbana. Plus, check out the latest products from Murad Skincare and Olaplex Hair Care. With hundreds of brands and gift ideas, there's something for everyone. Treat yourself to a free mini service from our experts and book an appointment at our salon to get holiday ready today. And as always, shop online 24-7. JCPenney, make your holidays count. Join us at Starbucks for the most magical time of the year when we don red aprons and handcraft delicious holiday drinks in our festive red cups that help get you in the holiday spirit. Stop into a Starbucks and taste the magic for yourself. Whether you're making the same breakfast that you have every day or baking a cake for an extra special day, eggs are a staple in our diets. Eggland's best eggs are nutritionally superior to ordinary eggs containing more vitamins and 25% less saturated fat. Not only are they better for you, but Eggland's best eggs taste better too. There's a reason that they're America's number one eggs. Visit egglandsbest.com for additional information and delicious recipes. Wayfair is ready to make your holiday season even more joyful. Shop all things home for you and everyone on your gift list with an incredible selection of furniture, decor, and more, all with an amazing value that'll make this holiday season the best one yet. And right now, Wayfair is turning up the savings even more with huge deals and sales, plus thousands of items ship fast and free. Head to Wayfair.com or download the Wayfair app in the App Store to shop the latest limited deals so you can deck it all. Ready to pop the question? The jewelers at BlueNile.com have got sparkle down to a science with beautiful lab-grown diamonds worthy of your most brilliant moments. Their lab-grown diamonds are independently graded and guaranteed identical to natural diamonds, and they're ready to ship to your door. Go to BlueNile.com and use promo code WELCOME to get $50 off your purchase of $500 or more. That's code WELCOME at BlueNile.com for $50 off. BlueNile.com.
It's the most beautiful time of the year, and JCPenney Beauty has gifts for all. Shop our newest brand, Smashbox and Too Faced Cosmetics, to check the glam off your list. Give it your all with designer fragrances from Calvin Klein and Dolce & Gabbana. Plus, check out the latest products from Murad Skincare and Olaplex Hair Care. With hundreds of brands and gift ideas, there's something for everyone. Treat yourself to a free mini service from our experts and book an appointment at our salon to get holiday ready today. And as always, shop online 24-7. JCPenney, make your holidays count. Join us at Starbucks for the most magical time of the year when we don red aprons and handcraft delicious holiday drinks in our festive red cups that help get you in the holiday spirit. Stop into a Starbucks and taste the magic for yourself. Whether you're making the same breakfast that you have every day or baking a cake for an extra special day, eggs are a staple in our diets. Eggland's best eggs are nutritionally superior to ordinary eggs, containing six times more vitamin D and double the omega-3s. Not only are they better for you, but Eggland's best eggs taste better too. There's a reason that they're America's number one eggs. Visit egglandsbest.com for additional information and delicious recipes. Wayfair is ready to make your holiday season even more joyful. Shop all things home for you and everyone on your gift list with an incredible selection of furniture, decor, and more. All with an amazing value that'll make this holiday season the best one yet. And right now, Wayfair is turning up the savings even more with huge deals and sales. Plus, thousands of items ship fast and free. Head to Wayfair.com or download the Wayfair app in the App Store to shop the latest limited deals so you can deck it all. When you're ready to pop the question, the last thing you want to do is second-guess the ring. At BlueNile.com, you can design a one-of-a-kind ring with the ease and convenience of shopping online. Choose your diamond and setting. When you find the one, you'll get it delivered right to your door. Go to BlueNile.com and use promo code WELCOME to get $50 off your purchase of $500 or more. That's code WELCOME at BlueNile.com for $50 off your purchase. BlueNile.com, code WELCOME. Whether you're making the same breakfast that you have every day or baking a cake for an extra special day, eggs are a staple in our diets. Eggland's best eggs are nutritionally superior to ordinary eggs, containing six times more vitamin D and double the omega-3s. Not only are they better for you, but Eggland's best eggs taste better too. There's a reason that they're America's number one eggs. Visit egglandsbest.com for additional information and delicious recipes. Wayfair is ready to make your holiday season even more joyful. Shop all things home for you and everyone on your gift list with an incredible selection of furniture, decor, and more. All with an amazing value that'll make this holiday season the best one yet. And right now, Wayfair is turning up the savings even more with huge deals and sales. Plus, thousands of items ship fast and free. Head to Wayfair.com or download the Wayfair app in the App Store to shop the latest limited deals so you can deck it all.